What's up? It's your boy PewDiePie 2012 PewDiePie here guys Apparently every single game ever decided to come out at the same time I'm sorry for the delay, but here we are with life is cringe before the storm episode 2 Apparently a ton of youtubers had a lot of difficulties with the first episode of getting it monetized But not this guy <laughs> Remember how I kept screaming across all the music? That's because I know. I know how the system works. So now they added a music slider. Let's put that shit shizzle. Shizzle. Down to one. While uh, also editing the settings. I don't know why I said editing. Changing the settings. They also have it hella high. What's the lowest then? Off. Not hella low. Well, there you go. There you go. Thank you very much, game. It's a shame because uh, the music is really one of the finer things with the show. It's really what personally resonated with me. I think it's a wonderful mix of uh, storytelling and, and music. I think it's a great thing. I found some few good songs myself from the first episode. Sorry. All right, here we go. What happened last episode? I can't believe it. <laughs> We barely started and I'm cringing. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Between your grades and your disregard for my rules, I see you slipping. I'm worried. Fine lip syncing there. Like each other, but you will respect me. Hello, Black Owl. Chloe, do something. Hey, do you know Rachel is a gamer? Uh, Rachel is totally a gamer. You didn't have to burn down a tree because of it. That's kind of fucked up, man. Come on, chill. Also, another cringe thing was that it took me about an hour and a half to figure out that the character was indeed not Max. It was the blue-haired girl. I don't know. <laughs> Sorry. All right. We look like we maybe have a meeting with a counselor or principal or something like that. Principal. Miss Price, how good of you to join us. You're welcome. I'm so sorry we're late. My my shift ran late at the diner and then just sorry. I Let us proceed. One we of don't, you here God is new to the Blackwell disciplinary process. And the other is all too familiar with it. Blackwell's code of conduct is built upon a foundation of mutual respect meant to foster an environment conducive to education and enrichment. When that respect okay. is violated... Reality check time. Yesterday did actually happen. I ditched school with Rachel Amber, and then Rachel really did start that fire. And that was after we actually agreed to run away from here. Right? Are you paying attention to me, Chloe? Um, what? Uh... Miss Price, the last time we met, an agreement was brokered. Do you recall what that was? Don't screw up. Uh, don't get in trouble again? Trouble is merely the byproduct, Miss Price. What's at issue is your attitude. We agreed that you would rededicate yourself to becoming an exemplary Blackwell citizen. We did. In the event that you were unable or unwilling to do so, we also agreed that it would become pertinent to reassess your future status at the Academy. Oh Despite my God. All this, you engaged in the following actions yesterday. Insubordinate language. Witnesses saying you were involved in bullying Nathan Prescott. The hell I was. I stood up for that little weirdo. Then how do you explain the desecration of Mr. Prescott's photography project? Well, clearly she didn't throw it! I didn't say I was successful. 
Say what you will about. This doesn't my happen in real life. Get out of here. Bully. Maybe you should be talking to Drew instead of me. You know, the guy who actually did what you're accusing me of. Mr. Damn North's right. Situation requires sensitivity. It will be handled separately. And Chloe's situation is less sensitive. Yeah. Yeah, that's do right. Not discuss other students' situations. We are here to discuss your daughter and her actions. Convenient. Mom, you know this is all bullshit, right? I'm beginning to suspect that myself. Yeah, boy! I am sorry you feel that way, but your daughter's misbehavior is real and serious. Do they know about the and burning yet, down of a tree? Your prodigious disciplinary record, Miss Price. We needn't discuss any of it. We needn't? No, because you severed your relationship with Blackwell the minute you left school grounds without permission. What does that mean? It means... You forced my hand. This is a consequence of your actions, Chloe. I have no choice I but to... I made her do it. What? 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 Yesterday was all me. My idea. I was having a bad day. I needed to blow off some steam. Well, it's true, actually. I took it too far. And also, Chloe I saw tried you... tried to talk me out of it. I've been down that road, she told me. You're better than this. But I wouldn't listen. Wow, wow. Drama class. See, Chloe was afraid I'd get in trouble or hurt. So she came with me. But only to keep me safe. I'm just sorry you got caught up in it, Chloe. That you allowed me to drag you down to my level. Can you forgive me? For what? You didn't do anything. Your willingness to stand by me, even now, is truly inspiring. <laughs> Chloe, is this true? Yes, it is it's true. It's true. <clears throat> I'm wearing the same shirt as totally yesterday. Totally not true. She really is an amazing actress. You think that was amazing? Are you kidding me? Miss Price. Yeah, fine. Fine, yes. It was her idea. But it's not like she kidnapped me. We were in it together. Miss Amber, based on what you've just told me, I have grounds to punish you. Are you sure what you've told me is the truth? <laughs> yes. This can't be the full story, Rachel. And this kid, I am an adult. Ray. What is up? Just to be clear, Miss Amber, you're sure Chloe Price didn't coerce you or... Coerce her? I'm just trying to get to the bottom of why someone like Rachel... Oh, I think we're clear, Principal Wells. Someone like Rachel, but not my daughter. Excuse me? Do you have a list of students you assume the worst about? Enjoy the show. You have no right to treat Chloe this way. This is because she's on financial aid, isn't it? Let's all just calm down. After everything we... She's been through in the last two years. You should be ashamed of yourself. Miss Price. Mrs. Price. Mrs. Oh. Price. I appreciate your position, but I assure you, it is only your daughter's past behavior that has led us here today. I understand, Mr. Wells. There is no doubt that Chloe's behavior must improve. But given what we've just learned about the negative influence she was under, I hope you will allow her just one more chance. Miss Amber, I am as surprised as I am disappointed in you. I understand. This being your first infraction in no way reduces its severity. Still, we will not be suspending you at this time. But However, you have squandered our trust, <clears throat> and you will no longer be my administrative assistant first period. Oh my god, no. And you will no longer be involved in Blackwell's performance of The Tempest. No. Ah, oh boy. Ah, oh boy. But the performance is tonight. For someone so aware of our school calendar, Miss Price, I would expect fewer absences on your record. Oh, Bazinga! She right. got Bazinga she Dinga. That show. Since this is her first infraction, Mr. Don't you Amber, think, uh... I don't tell you how to run the district attorney's office. Please don't tell me how to run my school. Oh, wow. 
Bedabbelsingen. There's a reason we have understudies for all circumstances, accidental and deliberate. I'm sure your understudy. Victoria Chase. Yes, I'm sure Victoria Chase will do fine. That is such... What was that, Miss Price? Chloe is upset for her friend, but we are both grateful that she is not going to be unduly blamed for what happened. There is plenty of blame to go around. Chloe's future at Blackwell will be discussed next, unless you had something to add first, Miss Price. We saw your mom, uh, go along with Rachel. Yeah, that's what she wants anyway. No. Nothing to add. I'm glad. Right? Though Chloe may not have been the mastermind of yesterday's events, it was, as I prefaced, the proverbial last straw. In light of your many past transgressions, I have no choice oh, but shizzle. to suspend you for the rest of the year. Oh, my, my but God. But it was the other girl's idea. She confessed. And she will be punished accordingly. But that does not absolve Chloe of her responsibility. You know what? I used to think Chloe was exaggerating about you, but now I see that she didn't go nearly far enough. Mrs. Price, let me remind you that Chloe's case for reinstatement begins now. Her actions and those of your own will be weighed carefully when the time comes. Do you understand me? Both of you. <laughs> yes or yes? Uh, let's see here. I'll go with yes, yeah. thank you. I mean... As much as I ever do. Chloe? We understand, Mr. Wells. I will have Skip Matthews escort you to clean out your locker. You may wait outside my office until he arrives. That is all. Good day, Mrs. Price. Mr. and Mrs. Amber. Ray. What an asshole! Well, I didn't do anything, man. I'm just a teenager, and I wanted to skip school. Man, if we skip school, there's no way we'd get in trouble. In Sweden, it's so easy. I'm and now sorry. I've never I'm been sent to the Can office like this. Later? You bet. You bet. Let's make out and finger. Sorry. I didn't get the chance to introduce myself. I'm Joyce. Mrs. Price. I'm Rose. This is James. I'm sorry we had to meet like this. No, I'm sorry. I'm sure for you this is an unusual circumstance. We really should be going. Nice to meet you. Hey, you'd see him. Bada bing, bada boom. Mom, I'm I'll see you in the parking lot. <sighs> hey, Chloe. I'm oh, wait, it's not him. You out. Just you and me. Hey, Skip. You know I was supposed to have today off, right? Sorry that my totally fair and impartial hearing inconvenienced you, man. I don't really care about any of this shit. Except my secret stash. Might as well grab my emergency joint while I'm here. Uh, let's look at the... Let's look at the doodle, man. That's... Yeah, let's look at it. I had big plans for adding to this collage. Oh well. Oh my god. I would always tag when I was a kid, like, everywhere. It's the cringiest shit, Dad man. Dad got Bongo from the rescue shelter. And I would always put, like, a... We, in, he got run over by a car. In Sweden, we have, like, snooze or whatever. Well, the story. Which is, like, tobacco no you... ever really rescued. I don't care about you. I'm trying to make this about me. Thank you, Chloe. Uh, it's tobacco you would put there, and there ha they had like a sticker underneath it, and I would put all of them inside the locker just to like, oh, look how much I snooze, man. Trusty keeper, my graffiti pets. Uh. <laughs> You've served me well. Maybe chem was the class I hated the least. Yeah, old girls like chemistry. What's up with that? That is a sexist statement, Felix. Well, it's true, okay? Hey, dude, don't, bo books are expensive. You can sell them. Come on. I didn't mean to trash it, I was gonna take it. She's gonna tag it in front of the security. Okay, okay.
Might as well. Okay, look, homework. I guess we can trash that. That guy looks so strange to me. Guess we'll take the picture of the cat. That's uh, this is important stuff, guys. We're really doing. It's Phil. I'm I'm immersed. The, what games would make you clean out a locker, huh? And not many, not many games. Look at that drawing. F this planet. Am I right? Uh, all right. Let's trash the geometry. You need a whole book about geometry. Wow, America. America, <laughs> am I right? Okay, let's trash that. Uh, let's trash that. This feels good. I enjoy it personally to throw away stuff, so this feels great. You, 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 people hold on way too much to materialistic items. Okay, okay, and let's get the emergency stash of, of weed. Which seems like a terrible idea to keep in a school. But I guess Jackpot. since... Jackpot. Jackpot. Wait. What the hell? No, no, don't fucking swear. Damn it, Justin. Oh my god. Damn it, Justin. <laughs> Chloe, hey yo, had to borrow your stash desperate times, you know. I promise I'll get you back next week. Okay, alright, listen up. If you're a teenager and you know about someone's secret stash, and it's not a secret stash and it's the fault is on you, Chloe. Second of all, if you take someone's secret stash, you don't leave a note, okay? What are you, stupid? Yeah, that's right, that's what happened. Fuck every inch of this place. I wish I could tag it from floor to ceiling. But with Skip watching me... <laughs> uh, bathroom. Then I'm out. Cool? <sighs> okay. But try to make it fast, will you? Just gotta let out that rage in the whammon bathroom. I'm gonna tag the shizzle out of that. Yes! Angry. Ah, so angry right now. That's a shizzy marker, Chloe. Alright, if you're gonna do it real, get a thick marker. What is that? That's like a kind of... Oh, that's not the size of your marker. You're cheating. She's cheating right here. Well, look at this. This is bullshit, man. That's not a tag. That's a drawing. What are you, silly? I don't care. Oh, wow, that's sick. How much ink is in that pen? Infinite? That's cool. No. No. Don't break it. So cringy. I love it. Don't tag bathrooms. This is annoying. This is like cowardice. You, you know, you gotta tag something decent at least. Not a nice place, but like, you know just some asshole is gonna have to clean that up. Right? It's it's your friend even, isn't it? Anyway, I guess she keeps going. She's a savage. It, she can't be helped. Is there? Oh my god! I thought it was a peener for a second. I'm leaving Rachel. What? Not obvious at all who did it. Oh my god! Who did this? Oh my god! Who could have been? <laughs> She's a savage, okay? She understands what it means to wear your hat li like whatever. Where did it go there? Okay. Oh, well, that's terrifying. What the heck is that? Is it gonna be a Halloween episode? That'd be dope. I would- I would appreciate that. Later, Skip. Yeah, enjoy cleaning up the bathroom, loser. Later. Oh, he- Looks listen. like David's here. Awesome. Hold on shift to move faster. Max would've loved this shit. Stupid Max, Another I don't- Another letter to Max. I don't care about you, uh, Max. I'll never send. At least journal Max won't abandon me the way real Max did. Oh my god, let it go, who cares? Chloe, you can't keep doing this and trim- Oh, wait. 
Let's jog over there. There's a pothole right there. Let's watch out. Maybe they'll use my scholarship money to finally fix this pothole. How does pothole exist? It's about damn time. David, Hi. please. Hi. I'll handle it. It's a me. Chloe, after today. Yep. Chloe, your mother and I have been talking. I don't care. I know. That's what we need to talk about. This isn't a fight, Chloe. It's a conversation. Remember that. <laughs> I don't need a conversation. Not with Sergeant Asshat here. I just need some space. Oh, Do not he looked like he was sad about it. Uh, she's my mother. If my mother has something to say, she will say it to me. She has. The problem is, you don't listen. Maybe if you try listening to me, instead of fighting me about everything, you might actually learn a thing or two. What? How to be a soldier? Soldiers put family and future above self and now. Getting kicked out of school? That's what losers do. David, that's out of line. <laughs> you weren't with us in there. Chloe was treated unfairly. Now you're making excuses for her? Chloe needs to take responsibility. I decide what Chloe needs, not you. Uh-oh. Right now, what I need most of all is for the two of you to start getting along. Chloe, I don't want to fight. I care about your mother very much. And you, too. I'd like for us to start over. What do you say? That was easy. Yeah, I, I'm not going to say no to that. Reset button pressed. I am glad to hear it. From now on, I will be assisting your mother in a few areas. Like making sure that you are no longer abusing drugs or alcohol. Oh, great. David, do you really think now is the right time? Joyce, please. We must be a united front. Mom. <laughs> <laughs> Chloe, I'd like you to empty your pockets and place all your belongings on the trunk of the car. What the fuck? If we are going to start over, we have to know that you are not abusing drugs. If you're not, you should be eager for the chance to prove it. Mom, you saw how I was treated in there. Now you want to treat me the same way? Uh, she's lucky. I don't need more discipline from you. I need my mom. I know, Chloe. And I'm sorry, but David feels... Joyce. Yeah. We feel this is the best way to start fresh. Chloe's manipulating go, her mom, Chloe. dude. Like, she's Wait, really stop. horrible to her. Oh, I need space. Like, oh. Don't you think? No, I comply. Fine. You want to see my shit so badly? Hey, remember the first season that had time travel? Yeah, me neither. <laughs> what is this? Is that a vape? Damn. Oh, it's a marker. Oh! Oh! Savage! You know what sucks Savage! even worse than invading someone's privacy? Doing it for no reason. Yeah, it's not like I was looking for drugs, literally. Awfully smug for someone who just got kicked out of school. Oh, David. <sighs> Chloe, I'm sorry. Can you forgive me? See, there you go. She, she shouldn't feel guilty about that. Yes. I forgive you. You were under a terrible influence. I just worry about you. But that's no excuse. Joyce, you can't start apologizing now. This will yes. only encourage her. That's enough out of you, David. We need to start treating each other better. And that means all of us. We need a new beginning. A new chapter. One that will involve the three of us together. Well, what does that mean? We both agree that the best thing for everyone at this stage is for me to move in. Yes. Yes. That's what I wanted. No fucking way. Chloe, what? after everything that's happened, 
Uh, I'm at a loss. I need help. Exactly. We need a firmer hand steering this ship. Talk to me, Chloe. Tell me what you're feeling. You're wearing too much makeup. You're kind of a bitch. I know I fucked up, man, but I'm trying. You're trying. I get it. I, I swear, I do. And I've been making it harder for you. But this is not the answer. It's the only answer I have, Chloe. In a million years, I never thought you'd choose David over me. There she go guilting her again. I'm sorry I took that for granted. That's not I'm what she's not doing. Anyone over so dramatic. Else. It's about the three of us having a home together. It'll be better than you think, Chloe. Once everything's running smoothly, you'll see what a stable home can be like. Whoa, where did they go? They teleported. What is happening? You know, maybe he'll let you drive the car. Stupid American cars with their flash. Get a Volvo. Okay. Hey. Oh. There is no home. Not if he's there. Oh my god. Chloe. Let her go. She'll come home as soon as her tantrum is over. She's gonna go on a tr drug tantrum. She just went on a marker tantrum. What kind of tantrum are we gonna see now? Oh yeah, she's gonna meet up with uh, Rachel. Life sucks, man. Every How do you know which way is up when your whole life has been turned upside down? God, it's so cringe. I can't. What the fuck? <laughs> How do you know when your whole life is just like, I'm just like smoking it up, dog? And like, my life, my life is crazy. It's crazy. I, I just got the baseball bat. I just got expelled. My daddy sucks. My life is hard, man. She doesn't understand. How did she get sex? Is Rachel not there? Black Hole's done with me. I can't go home anymore. Is this junkyard all I've got left? You're gonna hit the car or? Not the bot. She's out of control. She needs to be stopped. No. Oh. <laughs> no, no, no. That's a nice car, isn't it? It could have been. Hey, don't judge my opinion on cars. It was two years ago! I guess... I guess this kind of stuff you don't get over when you're a kid. Ugh. Maybe she can do it up with her new dad. It looks like a person. This thing is a mess. But maybe I can fix it. If this beast will ever run again, the first thing it needs is a new battery. Oh, I found one. Guess I was pretty pissed at Rachel last night. Amazing that someone I just met could have made me this angry. Amazing. Okay, so uh, we need to find a battery, but how, sorry, but how do I open the text again? Uh, maybe I need my daughter back. Maybe I just need space. Maybe I just need space, okay? 
Maybe I need my daughter back. Damn. Um, Elliot. Wait, which one is the latest message? This is it. Hey, after Tempest, you want to hang out? No. Ew. Wait, our principal? Oh, it's like an auto. Oh, okay. That's nice. You can get text messages from your principal. You're hella weird. You are. Seriously, we'll get their revenge. We'll get them. When did she text these? She's a texting pro. Maybe we can check the school bus for another battery. I wonder if I'll ever ride one of these again. Bim, I never ri ridden a school bus. In Sweden, don't we don't have them. Don't tell me what to do. Ooh, don't tell me what to do, girl. You best not be telling me. This looks like a new car. This thing looks somewhat new. Maybe the battery still works? A police notice. Wow. <laughs> Shitty ride, drug dealer. I really thought crime paid better. Open it. What are you trying to hide under there, Hood? When are we gonna see Max? You gotta pop the hood thing, you silly Billy. That's right. I call you silly Billy. What are you gonna do about it, huh? I'm savage, just like Chloe. Okay? You know it. Okay? Let's take it! Doesn't matter. Here we go. The voltage yeah, or anything like that. Any battery will do. Where did she put it? Where did she put the battery, huh? Where is the battery, Chloe? Where is the battery? Where did you put the battery, Chloe? My god. Some things best not to ask. Am I right? Do we have the car keys? Does she know how to, like, hotwire a car? Let's just put that in there. You almost kill yourself. Oh, le a screwdriver, that's all you need, baby. Just jam that in there. Damn. This thing needs more love than I can give right now. In the meantime, maybe I can spruce it up a bit. Yes! Yes! Love sprucing. Probably a good idea to cover over this with something. My peener. While an escape hatch could be nice, I should probably cover over this massive hole. And it anything else? I bet if I look, I can find something else to fix inside the truck. Uh okay. Maybe there's another light bulb I can put in here. We're gonna make, guys, we're gonna make it so nice. This place is gonna be so nice. Oh my god. This place is gonna be the best. Okay. Let's see what else this trash heap has to offer. We can use the mannequin head as a light bulb. And then a school bus, as a school bus. I wonder if I'll ever ride one of these again. You've already said that! Crazy. Okay, alright, okay. Hey, your light bulb, we find it. Take it. You might not work. Then again, I hardly ever work. See, Chloe is a very creative person. She has a creative soul in mind. She just like to contribute, you know? She just needs the right outlet to do so, 
Okay. You put your hand front graveyard, people say, ah, oh, trash. Chloe. She see future. She see art. You should cover that life endangering floor hole quite nicely. Why don't you put it over yourself then? Buzzing good, Chloe. That's right. I got more where that come from. No, 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 no. Uh, what was the last thing we needed? It was the floor. It was, uh, we need like a rug or something. Why not this then? I used to love opening up the diner with mom before school. I guess those days are now officially over. Yeah, because your dad died. Boom! Bazinga. Sorry. Here's a side of Arcadia Bay they don't put on the postcards. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's not nasty this at all. Could cover that torn seat and look awesome doing it. Yeah, that's probably doesn't have some disease on it. Let's go. We did it every many. Okay, okay. Very nice. Ooh, very nice. This is very nice. Come on, let's fix it. Fixing Felix, number one. The seat. Done. Done. We didn't even get to see her doing it because it's too much effort to animate. But there you go, we did it. Wow! That looks awesome! That looks like Jake Paul's new merch! That looks ha- Passengers enjoy the smell of sea salt and junkyard. Oh, hell yeah! Let's get the groovy light in there. Let's get one of those Philips Hue lights. Oh, it's gonna be red, dog. It's gonna be red, dog. Well, aren't you gonna try it? I guess not. I've seen the light. I got your shit. And it's awesome. This game makes me wanna be blind. Sometimes. Did I do it or? This like thing you. Looks like a rusted out shopping cart. Probably drives like one too. That's if it ever does drive, which seems questionable. Still, how sweet would that be? What is that phone, dude? It looks like a cigarette box. Yeah. Flip phone? Frank. It's Frank. Oh. Hey, Frank. What's up? Yeah, just checking in to see how you're doing. Really? No. Ha! <laughs> ha! I've got some business to discuss. Where can we meet? What about... Oh, like... Drugs? Price. I'm hanging out in the junkyard, north of town. The junkyard. That's great. Stay there, I'll see you soon. Okay. And, Frank? After you hang up, are you going to smash your phone? Like, in the movies? No. And so, can I smash it? Trust me, Price. If I ever have to smash anything, you'll want nothing to do with it. I'll see you. And I definitely don't want to smash you, is what I'm saying here. You didn't even cross Time your legs. Hard-earned smoke break. Hard-earned. Uh, let's turn Does it on. Does your truck look like an aquarium on wheels? <laughs> didn't think so. I don't know why I'm so harsh. Kind of cool that light. It's still burning. Yeah, good job there, buddy. Jeebus. Damn, forest fires are crazy, man.
Is it Regina Specter? Sounds like it. You of course can't hear it, but you know, that's that's the point. Thank you, copyright. Is she falling asleep? <laughs> Great. She's gonna have a nightmare. We're gonna play Nightmare Spectrum. Come on. Here it is. I'm calling it. Oh, look at that! Oh, it's a nightmare! Shit. I slept all day. And she's gonna get woken up by her, her friend later. When the scariest moment happened. Who's the crow man? It's crow man. It's her dead. Get it? Am I controlling this? No, I'm not. Definitely not. Oh, look, it's her daddy. Dad? Look at the fire. Who cares about I our dad? I wonder if it burned like this the day. Oh, that's morbid. The day it happened. How you doing there, Papa? Dad, what are we doing here? Is <laughs> he grieving? Marshmallow to the crow. Good talk. Good talk, my man. Let's do some marshmallows. That's too big to do marshmallows. Get out of here, Chloe. You can't possibly be serious right now. No, I I will not have you stick that giant stick through the marshmallow. How big are those mar- You got at least- How? This game is truly breaking ground. That made no sense. Let's get Ral here. Let's get Ral. Come on. More roasting, am I right? Uh, like I haven't roasted enough. <laughs> Good talk, buddy. Nice uh, two frame rate there on the fire in the background. <laughs> Amazing, isn't it? I can't look away. Sure. Don't pretend you're not mesmerized too. You kind of have a crow nose, is that why? See? You're so drawn to it, you don't even realize the danger. Danger? Fire blinds us, just like darkness. But darkness blinds with absence, with loss. What does fire blind with? Beauty. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. His eyes are going to turn but black. Sometimes there's a greater beauty yet to come. Incredible. Fire is jealous, Chloe. It wants all the beauty for itself. That's why you need to be careful. Oh, look at that. Careful of what? Oh, it's getting spooky. Oh, he's gonna get all demonic. Oh. Oh, wow. And then the friend will wake her up. Sorry, what? Oh, look at that. 
hasn't anyone ever told you not to fall asleep with a lit cigarette, you could start a fire. Oh, that's rich of you to say, am I right? Because you started the... Oh, I... Oh. I get it. So, are you going to invite me in? Or what? Uh, let's be a little flirtatious here. Okay, not sure. I don't know. I'm not supposed to give rides to strangers. What if I promise you free candy? Hop in. <laughs> Hop in. Is she running away for realsies? Damn, you've been busy. It's nothing. Just some junk I found lying around. Yeah, we spent about two minutes a on it. A rainbow towel? A freaky red light? Is she gonna notice Chloe, everything? This is incredible. I, I can't believe you found us an escape vehicle already. <laughs> like, for us to run away? Oh, I, I guess I wasn't thinking about it that way. Are you getting cold feet? I thought you were all bye-bye Arcadia Bay last night. I still am. I guess. You guess? It's not so easy. This truck doesn't even start, and we don't have any money. We can figure all of that out. I have no doubt. Besides, there's no rush. True. And no Blackwell. <sighs> Holy shit. <laughs> that Wells meeting. I'm so sorry. I can't believe he actually suspended you. Really? I'd say it's like the most believable thing yeah, that's ever saying. happened to anyone <laughs> in the history of forever. I'm just so pissed about the play. How could they let Victoria Chase jack your role? Yeah, Victoria because Chase is like the biggest the bitch. Told by an idiot, full of sound and fury, signifying nothing. Yeah. So woke. Totally. So. Whoa. At least Wells has no idea what really went down with us last night. Shit got pretty wild. Ooh, what do you mean us, huh? <sighs> last I checked, you're the one who went all puff the manic dragon on that tree last night. What were you thinking? I was angry. I didn't expect the whole stupid park to go whoosh. But come on, doesn't accomplice sound way cooler than accessory after the fact? Is that the official Arcadia Bay DA's opinion? Accomplice it is. I'd be way happier going to jail than having to live at home with Dick Tater David. He announced his plans to move in this morning. Oh, Chloe, that's awful. I'm so sorry. It's not that you bad. Know what we both could use? <laughs> Therapy. Therapy. You start. Kick back and tell me what's bothering you. I thought that's what she was doing. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. My god. Well, Doc. Let's start with uh, David. There's this dildo with a mustache <laughs> who's been dating my mom and now he thinks... <sighs> He's moving in with us. How do I stop him? Hmm. That's a hard one. I'm not sure there's really anything you can do. Because you're not an what adult! What talking to you for? Just because you can't stop him doesn't mean you don't fight back. The resistance begins now. Ugh. Alright. You're going to need a new nickname to mark your enemy. What have you got? Step... What's the most Christian? Step douche, thank he's, you. Uh, step douche. That's right, step douche. Because he's douche. inserting himself where he doesn't belong. That's right. Also, he's a douche. Oh my God. Poetic. May I also suggest step ladder? <laughs> Why step ladder? Because I get it. He climbs on your mom every night. Ew! And pretty soon they'll be <sighs> stepping down the aisle. What the hell kind of therapist are you? <clears throat> Sorry. It's called shock therapy. Highly controversial. 
Okay, your turn. That was actually somewhat therapeutic. Thank you. It's always a pleasure delving into the mind of Chloe Price. And now it's your turn. Tell me all about what it's like being daughter of Arcadia Bay's most famous scumbag. It sucks. Too blunt? Sorry. I do that sometimes. Nah, I'm just... Ugh, I don't know. Oh, yeah, no, lean in. Lean in, girl. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Can we talk about something else? Of course. Fuck. No, it's a I truck. Damn it. Fix the truck a bit. That might mean I have life skills. Something I've really tried to avoid. That's right. Changing Upshot. battery is extremely I'm difficult. I'm closer to becoming a car thief. That's pretty badass. Do you think there's a point when you've been acting so much that you don't even have your own personality anymore? You're yep. just whatever you think other people want you to be. I think you have a personality. I wasn't talking about me. My dad doesn't really exist. You saw him in Wells' office. The whole thing is a performance. And now I'm starting to feel like Everything in my life is bullshit. But he's still my dad. How can I make sure I don't end up like him? You just need someone around who likes you for who you are and isn't afraid to call bullshit when needed. Let me know if you find any candidates for the job. Uh, I was clearly talking about myself. But uh, thanks for the bazinga. Shit. It's playtime. Gotta go clean out my dressing room for Victoria. Not exactly the role I thought I'd be playing tonight. Oh well. Oh well. Hey, I, I was thinking that after the show, maybe we could go do something. Just you and me. Something criminal? Criminally fun. I'm sounds here. sounds good. Sounds spicy. Wait, you forgot your bag. It's for you. <gasps> Just a little survival kit for your new life on the lamb. Drive safe, Chloe. Oh my God! What's in the box? Bag. <laughs> I can't wait. What do you think? Leave a comment right now. <sighs> And I'm gonna guess, I'm gonna guess, uh, a, a new outfit. A new out. It's a new outfit. It's a, it's a kit on how to dye your hair blue. Hello, junk shack. Come on. They mess with the feel of you in this one. It's kind of interesting. Oh yeah, this was her, like, we found Time this. Time to check out Rachel Amber's mystery bag. Wow! Uh, this was, we found this when we were looking for, uh, people. How much spare time does this woman have? That looks terrible, I'm sorry. Let's just check the damn bag. A bag full of clothes. Told you. Ten points to me. What did you guess, huh? Yes, I need those. And the hair dye. Come on, where's the hair dye? No, they're probably going to end it on it. They want to make it a big deal. Oh, look, she has the hair now. Her ch character has changed. I got an achievement. Chloe was here. Alright, let's snatch up the place a bit. Very nice. As you all know, you can literally just put a nail inside any... Oh look, there was one there already. How convenient. Everyone just keeps nails in their concrete, don't they? 
<laughs> How? Yeah. Okay, okay, all right, okay. That looks really good there on the tire. I would have gotten more for a wall thing, but you know. Enough messing around. Bag time. Didn't I just check the damn bag? Oh, there's more. <laughs> Nothing like an abandoned shack in the middle of a junkyard to make a girl feel like exploring a new wardrobe. Look at those edgy clothes. No, I'm not feeling it. Nope. Change. Do we actually get to pick the outfit or what's happening here? Uh, Rorschach skull. Bonus outfits. Let's try the bonus. Uh, did I pay for this? Hot dog man. Are you serious? This is DLC. Obviously, Hot Dog Man wins. Well done, developers, for sneaking that one in there. All right, he's at the junkyard. Let's go meet him. Is he the drug guy, isn't he? Who are you? That's the woman we saw with Rachel's dad. Oh my god. Weird. Yo, Frank. It's Chloe. I don't know the secret password, man. Is the password drugs? Price. Get it your worked. ass in here. <laughs> Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Dude, it smells like piss in here. Shut it looks up. nice. You have a rough night or something? Every night's a rough night. I've got a notebook in the back somewhere. Go get it for me, would you? Who is that? Well, ah! Ah! God. Jeez, man. Oh, he took off. Price. I was like, what happened? Then we'll talk. Now I'm fetching things on the road Frank. again. That's kind of cool. Dude, I heard the bad news. Suspension sucks. You mean good news? I'm stoked. Word. I'm home too. I finally got busted yesterday for smelling like weed. My mom's making me go to her book group. Oh, man. That sounds awesome. You know what? I would love to How go. How low can I go? Hmm? That looks like vomit. Wow, look at this cereal. Is that a no? mind if I do. Don't even fucking think about it. Damn. 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 Part of a balanced breakfast. Do I really want to see Frank's bedroom? I want the damn note is what I want. Got it. She's so edgy. My God! <laughs> Do I really want to see Frank's bedroom? Say that again. Say it. Say it again. Say it. Again. What the heck has he done to that pillow, oh, man? Oh yeah, he has a dog. Hey there. It's okay. Oh, okay. it's a puppy still. Oh, shit. Pompadou, get up here. Oh shit. Pompadou. Pompadou. You little killer. 
That's adorable. It doesn't become adorable though. Spoilers. They make it impossible to find these things. So suspended means you can go back to school? Seems pretty chill, dude. Dude, that guy has a lot of beans. <laughs> Bomb uh. sauce. For the man who enjoys searing pain with his drive through order. Where the heck is this stupid? Thing? Frank and his BFF. That's. That's probably there the notebook is. Frank wants. So, so this is 2010, huh? That's probably why everything is so cringy. Anything from the past is cringy. Except is that t-shirt. That t-shirt is 10 out of 10. I think it is. Ah, shit. I'm in the red. Time to find out what Frank wants to discuss. A betting slip. $1,200? Way out of my league. Can we talk to him or? Yeah. Is this it? Have a seat. Pompadour, huh? That's one badass name for a dog. It's French. <laughs> it's cute. Okay, but he's not a poodle, Frank. No, he's not. But I'm gonna treat him like one. <laughs> okay, so who was that woman? What woman? The one I saw coming out of your RV. Oh yeah, I meant to introduce you. Her name is Mind Your Own Fucking Business. Savage. I want an answer. Let's Rachel would want to know more. I bet I can convince Frank it's harmless to tell me. I've only done this twice Dude, and I don't really understand how it curious. works. I'm just curious. What's the big deal? Idiot. I make money by being discreet. So you're supposed to... Oh. No shit, Frank. You think I don't know about hiding things from other people? You're supposed to pick out their teenager. words. Come on, Price. I gotta protect my clients. Happy customers are the foundation of a good business. Your customers like you because you're laid back. That's why I like you. So you should keep building up that easygoing vibe, you know? Sure, I guess. So why are you so hung up on this chick? Come on, Frank. This is Arcadia Bay. Gossip is all we have to keep us from hanging ourselves out of boredom. Yeah, see, it's working. I don't know. Frank. Talk. And I'll get my mom to make you something special. Like what? It worked. Uh, How about that firehouse chili of hers? You, you got it. That sounds good. The woman you saw. Her name's Sarah. Showed up a few weeks ago. Causing all kinds of trouble for all sorts of people. Like who? It's a little out of your league, okay? But what kind of trouble exactly? Forget about it, Chloe. Shouldn't have opened my mouth. Thanks for telling me. She is causing all kinds of trouble, all right? You hear the mill burn down? <laughs> no. Shit. Really? Crazy. My friend Damon runs the place. He lost a lot of money last night. Uh-oh, he finds out it was us. We're going to be in big trouble, man. Money from what? Well, he's always had a few things going on. I help him out with some of them. Don't drown me in the details, Frank. Lately, he's been doing some stuff that I don't like. But I don't seem to have much leverage with what him. What the heck? That's sausage again! Anyway, you and I Not have the dog. to discuss. Is this about the buck 75? What? The money that I owe you? Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, I, I don't give a shit about that. Wait, do you have it? Ha! <laughs> Don't you have richer clients to bother? I should fucking hope so. Well, good. Because I need everything I've got. You're a pain in the ass. I've got bigger problems right now. Open my notebook. Last page. 
Should be some entries for a kid named Drew. You know him? <laughs> Drew North? Y yeah, he's... Holy shit. That's a lot of money. Drew runs Oxy for Damon. Apparently football players eat it like candy. That's smart, I guess. That car is it massive, dude. Well. Go Bigfoots. Problem is, I want it. Drew owes a grant, and he's not answering Same my calls. Cozy. You know what's going on with him? Uh, he's an unreliable douchebag. No, this is the first time he's done this. Kid's actually smart. Anyway, here's the job. I'm taking you to Blackwell. Go to Drew's room, find the money, and I'll meet you to pick it up. Can you handle that? Yeah, what do I get from this exchange? Yeah, of okay. course, but what's in it for me? Yes, Idiot. You still what Daenerys will me get? So, if I do this, then we're good? That, and I'll do even better. I'll give you a 10% cut of the money. Damn, okay. damn, dog. Yeah, sure. Oh, that could be the money that we escape okay. with. Of course. What's the matter? Chuf chuf, I'm in. It might Let's be a go. Little tough. I, I'm not supposed to be at Blackwell. I got suspended this morning. Congratulations. Still easier for you to go on canvas than for me. If you can't even do this price, a hundred dollars closer to leaving Arcadia Bay with a bit of cash. And the truck fixed. Rachel and I could really do it. We could leave for good. You're right. A hundred bucks. That's all you need to run away. Good deal. So we're going back to school to play D and D, son. Hell yeah! That was awesome. Can we do that again, please? Is that fire still going on? God damn. How long does forest fires go on, man? Didn't think I'd be back this soon. Well, here goes nothing. Back at school yet again. They've got some tents up for dressing rooms. What are you up to? I'm here too, actually. Running an errand for later. Oh, really? So bad. Come, come see me. Oh, Better okay. hurry up and get into the dorms. Oh, uh, we've been here. There was one of my favorite puzzles here when the game actually had puzzles in it. Let's talk to her. Hey, Steph. Whoa. Hey, Calamastia. Surprised to see me on parole? I told you Wells was out to get you. That text was a rare courtesy, by the way. I don't normally get involved in other people's dumb decisions. Thanks for trying, but skipping yesterday was totally worth it. Skipping with Rachel Amber does have an appeal. Well, yeah. So what are you doing here? I'm just picking up something from Somebody. It's for a friend. Now There's I'm no one really else at this school. Curious. What are you doing? What's all this stuff? I'm prepping for the Tempest show tonight. I'm the stage manager. Oh, right. Uh, I think I knew that. Honestly, the show's really good. It's worth seeing. I'm sure it is. I am worried about Victoria coming in now and trying to hog every scene, but the cast overall is fantastic. You get to see a totally different side of everyone, especially the guys. Oh jeez, well then I'm okay. intrigued. I'm intrigued. Go on. Like Hayden's so annoying, but when he puts on that crown, he's actually very princely. And Nathan no. is Caliban? There's so much depth there. Right. Depth. Yeah, well, good luck with all of that. 
Maybe I'll see you later. Oh, hey. I wanted to ask you something. Shoot. I've been planning to make a move on Rachel, but not if you two were together. Oh my god. Oh my make god, a she move? Wants so, she wants are you? Uh, no, no, I mean, no, 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 no. Or maybe no, yours no, no. in Rachel's business? But if you feel comfortable telling me. Yeah. You think we're together? It looks to me like you've got a thing for her, and maybe she has a thing for you. And I wouldn't want to get in the way. I'm... Uh, I, I don't know. It's... It's, it's hella confusing. Confusing. <laughs> yeah, I, I can imagine. You ever want to talk to me, Chloe? You know you can, right? I'll see you later, Steph. Have fun storming the castle. Notice when everyone ever says, hey, you could always talk to me. You never talk to those people. You always go to someone else. Hey, look, it's Shaggy from Scabadoo. Let's go inside the dorm. Wait, Locked. she sleeps here? Look. Figures. Looks like I guess my she options doesn't. are become a master lock picker or swipe someone's keys. Okay, well, let's just ask her. I'll see you at the Tempest, right? No, I'm expelled, you dumb bech. If only we had the time travel thing. Instead of this lame telling... Hey, that's Bingo. Nice. If only those keys Slap were unsupervised. That What's Samuel working on? Uh, the sprinklers? I know what we need to do. We need to fix the sprinkler. Right. If Samuel's working on the sprinklers, some damage here might get his attention. But Evan is right there. Is that hipster taking a picture of a sprinkler? My god. Shh. What are you doing here? Aren't you supposed <laughs> to be at home thinking over your endless list of questionable decisions? Dude, oh! why do you care about my questionable decisions? It offends me when intelligence is wasted. Oh, wow. <laughs> Did Evan just He must be a Rick and Morty fan. Damn straight. Wow. Evan looks really ridiculous. Chloe? Uh-huh? I've learned something about myself recently. Something that I think you might understand. I've learned that if I'm passionate about something, it's probably the right thing to care about. For example, I've been trying to get the students and administration interested in forest fire prevention. That is kind of an odd topic to focus on. Yeah, it's not like a giant fire is going on. People are so eager to pass on responsibility to anyone else so that they can live comfortable, unworried, and ultimately meaningless lives. You see what happened? <laughs> Looks like you were right. Go, Evan. You're a hero of the people. Oh my I god. I feel like I do. A about different things, I'm sure. But you only give a shit about what you give a shit about. I like that. I anyway, you're not supposed to be here. You should leave. What? What conversation was that? You only care about what you care about, and I want other people to care about uh, other things. But I like that about you, that you don't care about- What? What are you saying? You're crazy. We're gonna break his camera, aren't we? Um. Huh. That's some intellectual shit, Samuel. Yes, Samuel. Nice work, Samuel. Nice- Nice work, Samuel. Such a nice white door. What? <laughs> Though, it feels like it's missing something. Doesn't Are you gonna it? tag in Too front bad of him? I can't tag it with Samuel standing right there. Come on, slap that ass. Come on, slap that ass. How do I get Samuel out of there? It look hey Samuel. Keeping busy? Always, Chloe Price. I didn't think you'd be returning to these hallowed halls so soon. Oh my god, he's so creepy! <laughs> Neither did I. I have the feeling it 
wasn't uh, the books or bricks of Blackwell that led you back. <laughs> uh. What? You're here for someone. A special someone, yes? What do you think of uh, Rachel Amber? Rachel Amber is a dragon made of diamonds. Uh. That's, uh, deep. <laughs> Do you just make this shit up on the fly, or do you, like, write it down beforehand? He looks like he writes Sonic fanfiction. all the time because you like the way it feels? Or is it merely a desperate defense against experiencing true intimacy with others? Ooh! Is this... Is this neighbor for real? What, what in the... What are you talking about? I'm, uh... <laughs> Looking for Drew North. Most look at Drew North and see only the athlete, but he is more than that. He is? Oh, Jesus. A great heart he has with much love he stares. and no he stare. room for fear. Oh, I've always thought he was kind of a boy. Oh, and that chub. He look at that chub, that man. too. No one is just one thing. Okay, I gotta go. Okay, I've, I've got to go. go. Man. Uh, it's been real. Yeah, no, Be real is... kind to yourself, Chloe Price. Oh my god, thank god that's over. There was bleach right there, I was so tempted. Okay, alright, okay, okay, alright. We need to get in somehow, huh? It's a puzzle, isn't it? It's a puzzle. This is the puzzle area, everyone. It's a branch. I found a tree branch. I'm standing in concrete. Oh, I did it! Let's graffiti it. They're just too high risk. Okay, we did it. I would have gone with a classic penis, but you know. To each his own. Max would have jumped on that photographer position. Come on. Yeah, stupid Max. I don't so care about you, Max. Evan will see me, for sure. And he sounds like he's in the mood. Got him. Hey. Shit. I wanted you to go the other way. Like, as far as possible, the other Oh, way. I see. We got it. Sorry. <laughs> She's such an asshole. Time for a fresh start. Time for a fresh start. The bird. Here we go. It's the bird. Come on. Get rid of that bird. One small flight for this bird, one giant leap backward for Chloe Price. Oh my god, it's painful sometimes, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, leak backward, got it. So this is not it. Okay, 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 I get it. I see it now. Hey, 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 hey don't flip at the bird. There. Don't flip at the bird! The bird did nothing! Alright, now we scared this direction, and it will fly away! Fly, fly, little bird! Gotcha. I get it now. I thought I had to use the- Perfect. The... Oh, this is beautiful! You got a hipster gasm right there. Okay, okay, let's break. Sorry, janitor. Awesome. Now I just have to wait for Samuel to turn on the. <laughs> that works. That's crazy. I can't believe it just broke by itself. We did it, guys. We're li straight up savage. Savage, man! 
So cool, man. All right, let's take the keys. Sorry, Samuel. Bazinga, right. as I like to say. Time to find Drew's room. Like how we're jogging over there. Let's uh, unlock. No time like the present. Unlock the door and then return the keys straight away, please. What are you doing? Oh wow! Oh oh! <laughs> hey, Skip. How's it going? Not that it isn't great to see you and all, but what are you doing here? Yeah, what are you doing Did he, here? You just get suspended. Relax. I'm just uh, visiting a friend. I, I can't. I really can't just let you go in. I'm going inside, dude. You're just gonna have to let this slide. Come on, we can I do this. I don't think I can. In fact, I think I have to ask you to state your official business or else vacate Blackwell property. I hate to do this to Skip, but I've got to get inside. Maybe if I make him really uncomfortable, he'll feel guilty and let me pass. Such an asshole. What's my official business? Women's business, Skip. As in, my uterus? I need to <laughs> use the restroom. Glad you asked. Women bit. Come on, this, you not no. respect women? No, it's my job to ask, Chloe. Your job is creepy, then. Which makes you kind of a creeper. Oh, it's not like that. Do you know what Wells would do to me if I didn't, you know, patrol? You know Wells doesn't really respect it's you, It's doing well. Right? You're just a, a rent-a-cop who needs a haircut. I thought we were friends. Where is this coming from? He's so mean! Yeah, I thought we were I, friends too. I thought we were friends too. But when the man comes down on you, you come down on me. Is that it? Last look, one. Look, come look. on. I'm really sorry, Chloe. Come on. Last so one. I'm confused right now. You just looked at my tits. Just look the other way, Skip. Oh, we didn't do it. Like we fucked up. Criminal. I no, we did it. Need to use the bathroom. I, I don't know what to do. Seriously, my uterus is on fire, dude. <laughs> She's what doing the Jenna Marbles voice. My I uterus is, is on fire. I don't want to know. But... En fuego utero, <laughs> Skip. En fuego utero. I don't. I don't know what to say. I'm so sorry. Yeah, that's right. You better be. <sighs> Imagine I'm if here? your peener was on fire. Of an unknown vehicle in the parking lot. <sighs> Thank God. Oh, I'm on it. I won't tell Wells. Do what you have to do, okay? I won't tell anyone. Legend. Hey, we got a message for. How's it going? It's going great. Thank you. Let's go. I'm guessing they were talking about Frank's car. Which is not good. It's gonna be pretty crazy if he... I don't use those keys. How, don't we need the keys to enter the room, though? All right. Which... Which one? Um... Ba -ba -da -bim. Thou shall not pass. I don't think that's him. Break a leg tonight. That is really gross. I wonder what Max would think. Nathan Prescott. Yep. Yeah, uh, definitely Drew's room. Whose whose room am I looking for exactly? Sorry. Elliot Hampton's room. Wonder what he's up to right now. Uh, we don't really have time. Uh, was it this one? I 
think so. <laughs> Look at all that football. What a nerd. Oh, is that the D and D guy? Good. <sighs> Drew's not here. Okay. <laughs> if I were Drew, where would I hide my money? Um. Oh, man. Looks like Drew's dad is having a hard time. <laughs> <laughs> they look so happy. Oh yeah, they were brothers. Okay, yeah, yeah now I remember. Mikey's figures. <laughs> Playing that game yesterday was actually fun. It was. Oh, hello, 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 a letter. Holy shit, Drew. A college scholarship? No wonder you're so into football. How come uh, people get paid to play football in America? I didn't realize Drew was this good at sports. I bet he can't wait to get out of our... Frank wasn't lying. So many folks are shit out of luck around here. Too bad I lost my release form. I was really looking forward to running all those. Bet the dinner choices are steak or steak. That's hilarious. <sighs> For the love of God. <laughs> Why? Um, I can't really look in. Oh, there's the trunk. Last place Is you look. Is the money isn't it? in there? Oh, right. oh, and we got to snoop around for the post four code. Digit code. Uh, probably on I the computer, right? I didn't realize Drew was this good. Frank wasn't. So many folks are shit out of luck around here. No, it At doesn't look Drew like it. At least Drew has some prospect. Plenty of possible combinations here. Oh, uh, yeah. Could his birth date... Uh... Drew is April 3rd. And Michael North, his brother is. No, Drew is the young one. Plenty of possible combinations here. No, that wouldn't fly. A lot of numbers on here. Would Drew really use something like this for a lock combo? No, I don't think so. Probably, maybe behind the... <laughs> they look so happy. Hmm. Holy shit, Drew. A college scholarship? Hmm. I wonder exactly how important 516 is to Drew. Hmm. Durgaron, bad guy. Uh, awesome. <laughs> Looks like Mikey's been staying here with Drew. Well, it must be the plenty of possible then. combinations here. But I don't know. It's a four-digit code. Okay, apparently I... Uh, in America, you put the months first. How about that? Doesn't make any sense, but no. There you go. Yes. Bingo. This is kind of fun. <laughs> Ah, oh. did little Drew beat you up too? Oh, just get the money, dude. Jackpot. I'm kind of good at this. Someone's gonna walk in now. You know it. Okay, got the money. Time to. Oh, wow. Hey, Elamon. Chloe? What are you doing here? Cool story, bro. Haha. <laughs> Good meme, buddy. I was <laughs> looking for your brother, but 
Uh, he's not here, so. Why? Bro, we gotta go. Yesterday wasn't enough? You wanna go another round? Doesn't matter. Mikey, get your stuff, let's move. Drew, relax. Slow down. What? Oh, that's the guy. Shit. The drug guy. You're making me think you're nervous about something. Who the hell is that? No one. Stay in here and don't say anything, little brother. Whatever you do, don't open the door. What in the world is happening? You know what's going on? Damon, you shouldn't have come here. School's not the place for this. Really? <laughs> Damon, don't come like here. Fucking money. Shit. I told you, I don't have it. Sales are down, man. Nobody wants to get high right now. But look, it's spring season. We just started two a days. Those are gonna kill us. I'll be able to sell all the oxy you've got. Drew, you owe me a grand. Where is it? I said I don't have it right now. I heard about your dad's job, by the way. Tough time. Yeah, bet a grand would mean a lot to him right now. Where's my money, Drew? Oh, shit. I don't know what you expect me to do. I can't just make money appear out of thin air. I want my fucking money. You don't have to hit me, man. I'm going to... Where is it? Please, just give me one week. You're just going to lie there? I thought football players were supposed to be tough. <laughs> Sorry to have to do this, kid. No one steals. It doesn't from sound me. real at all. It sounds like it's like inside a canister or something. Fuck. He did say stay with Mikey, so that's what we're gonna do. Let me go. No. Your brother said to stay inside. It'll be okay, Mikey. It'll be okay. Damn. You are one tough kid. Fuck you. Yeah? Well, what about this? Hmm. Ah! Good luck running on that knee now. Ah! Bye bye, football. <coughs> well, I'm done. Get my money. Or maybe it'll be your little brother I talk to next. See you soon. Damn. That got real. That got dizzled, man. <sighs> Uh, Drew! It's, it's okay. I'm okay, little brother. Thank you, Chloe. <laughs> oh, she's, he's thanking Thank us. You. Oh, that's a tough one. Uh, here. It sounds like you could use this. You took this from my locker? Frank uh, asked no. me to. I... I didn't know. I, I'm sorry, man. My dad. He... He needs this money. Way more than that asshole does. Thanks. Drew! Good dag. You Good need talk. to get to the hospital. Shut up, Harry Potter! <laughs> Don't tell anyone about this, okay? Yeah, no. No way. What, um, what are you going to do? <sighs> about Damon? I don't know. <sighs> One day at a time. I hear you. Seems like you're down on your luck there now, boy. A grand? That's no good, man. Why are you dealing drugs? Huh? Don't be dealing drugs. Man. Listen to Father Felix. You don't deal drugs unless you need a grand. Then you do it. You're welcome. Infinite vi wisdom. Wisdom. Shut up. From me. Feeler. Feeler, Father Feeler. That is my name. Very nice. Amen. Uh, 
it bothers me how that fire is still going on. Is no one doing anything? This is going to be where the play takes place. I look forward to see it. Is this backstage? This day has been so... <laughs> yeah. So messed up. And that's before having to watch Victoria butcher Rachel's role. At least I can be here for Rachel. <laughs> if I can... Rachel? Is she still going to partake? You got this. You got this. Oh, shit, shit, shit. I can't do this. I'm going to ruin oh. the play. Believe in yourself. After the drugs. She drinks drugs with tea. Legend. What are you two doing here? Two? <laughs> oh. Or did you forget? You let this loser dropout sabotage you. But really, I should be thanking you. Now I have everything I wanted. And you've got a new friend. So I guess we're both doing great. Now please leave so I can get ready for my performance. Even though I wish I was the one performing tonight, Victoria, I really am happy for you. I hope it's <laughs> everything she... you want it to be. We what? both do. Right, Chloe? No, no. No. Oh, we can actually get Victoria Rachel to quit. Might be Let's try the it. High road, but not me. I know how much she wants to perform. All I need to do is convince Victoria that it's in her best interest. Why not? Just for fun. I, I know it's know. kind of a dick move. Have you really thought this through, Victoria? Performing tonight could be the equivalent of social suicide. What are you talking about? You think I'm going to take advice from a loser like you? Don't you know your Shakespeare? Tis better to have loved and lost than never to have gone on stage and made a complete ass of yourself in front of everybody. <laughs> ever. That actually worked. I wasn't sure about that one. People love theater. It's cool. High school is war. Theater is that part of war where you get impaled by a spear and you shit your guts out and then all your friends Just one more. You. Come on. Come the on. I want to do this. At Blackwell are venerated by uh, What am I saying? I don't have to justify myself to you. Justify. Do whatever you yes. want. But trust me. If you go on stage tonight, we did it. You'll be the only one out there not getting the joke. Chloe, you're being a little harsh, don't you think? No, she's right. She yes, is? I am. Oh, what was I thinking? Oh, look at this thing. Oh, I can't go yeah. on like this. I can't play this part. I don't know the lines. I don't understand the stupid play. I don't even like theater. You don't know the lines? Hello? I was cast as understudy to you? What were the chances I was actually going to be here? So... I quit. The show can go to hell for all I care. I'm not going down with it. Yes! You did yourself, Price. <laughs> I guess I did. <sighs> I better get ready. Sweet pardon. We're ruined. The show is ruined. That was quick. <laughs> My dear young artists, a misfortune most unkind has befallen us. Juliet is waylaid. 
That infernal inferno is the culprit, closing down the roads and robbing us of our aerial. Would that she could but manifest on her master's whim as a true spirit. Alas, devoid of an understudy, the situation is a dire one indeed. I'm afraid we may have to cancel. Truly, we are a cursed lot. Even my prodigious imagination cannot conceive of a worse turn of fate. That's it. I will not abide this lack of professionalism any longer. I quit! Victoria? Oh! In fact, I am protesting the entire Blackwell Arts Program. It's time Wait. our what? talents were appreciated and not squandered by subpar faculty. <laughs> Good luck with your train wreck. Touché, fates. Touché. Mr. Keaton, perhaps I could fill in for Victoria? My dear, your visage is as a vessel sent by the heavens to offer passage to my stranded soul. But I'm afraid without but... our Ariel, all is still lost. Oh my! What? Yeah! Uh, uh, oh, no. Mr. Keaton. No. Chloe could step in for Juliet. No fucking chance. At least until the road's clear. The cynic. She's the right fit for Juliet's costume. She is indeed. Oh my god. Tell me, my dear. This is amazing. Have you ever acted before? Hell no. She's being modest. We play improv games all the time. And she's fantastic at it. My dear, what if I told you that the entire fate of the production rests upon your slender shoulders? I'd say you're super fucked. Chloe. Please, for me. Come on, Chloe. For Rachel. For Rachel. Please, <sighs> do it for her. You want her. It. Say it. <laughs> I can't believe Rachel's talked me into this. I, aren't I supposed to be expelled? How are they texting about this right now? Why don't they just talk to each other? Oh my god. Why does it feel like Steph is mocking me from afar? Moshinderu. Okay, I mean, I guess we're done, right? I can't leave until I've looked at the script at least once. Oh my god. I hope it's not long. I can't remember lines. It's so difficult. I suck at I it. Seriously, have to memorize all of this? It's not too bad. Do I actually have to memorize it? Seriously, Are they gonna ask me to later? Memorize all of this. Thanks, Rachel. All hail, Great Master. I do. Okay. 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 Uh, Border King's Chief and Abbey Cabin. Okay, okay, not so. Okay, okay. Okay, okay, I got it. I got it. I got all of it. That's right, all of it. No probs. Easy. This will be easy. This will be easy, guys. This will be a cake in the pake. By as accident, I say in Sweden. most strange, bountiful fortune hath mine enemies brought to the shore. Here, cease more questions. Thou art inclined to sleep. Tis a good dullness, and give it way. I know thou canst not choose. Come away, servant. Come. Ah, shit. I'm on. Ha <laughs> oh, ha. Oh, that's you. I am ready now. Get up there. Approach, my Ariel. Come. Damn it. No problem. I've got this. I just walk to Rachel and say my mark. Oh, this is so crazy. I even have a mark. <sighs> All hail, great mistress. I, uh, I come to answer thy best pleasure. Most fearless, <laughs> generous spirit. Hast thou performed to point the tempest? That Sorry I about that. Uh, creative cloud adobe. Uh... I boarded I the king's ship. Boarded the king's ship. In every cabin, 
I flamed amazement. The fire that was good. and cracks of sulfurous roaring, the most this is painful. mighty Neptune seemed to besiege and make his bold waves uh, tremble. My brave <laughs> spirit, who was so firm, so constant, that this coil would not infect his reason. Uh, not a soul. The king's son, uh, Ferdinand, <laughs> was the first man that leaped from his ship and cried. I have no idea what this story is about. Cried, hell is here and all the devils are here uh, because I don't hell think that was right. Here. <sighs> Close enough. But are they, Ariel, safe? All right. I guess this is when I'm supposed to walk somewhere. <laughs> I'm definitely supposed to do something with this. Oh, okay, okay, okay. We're close. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Not a hair perished. And uh, as thou baddest me, I have dispersed this is them fun. about the aisle in... Troops! Bravo! Ariel. Yes! Thy charge exactly is performed. But there's more work. More lines? Is there more toil? Let me remember thee what thou hast promised. How now? What is't thou canst demand? Liberty? My liberty. Indeed. Thy <laughs> liberty? Nay, this most of all I will not grant. Th that's not her line. Is it? What's going on? I never said how dearly I hold thee. My habit's been to keep my soul well draped. She's confessing through Most the play. loyal spirit, companion, and friend. Is acting in my service not replete with excitement, amusement, and delight? Of course, mistress. <laughs> Most truly, it is so. Mr. Keat, they're way off script. It's magical. <laughs> then why, I pray you, wish you to be free? Excitement's a mere counterfeit of bliss. These storms and these adventures, I prefer to know thou still cared for my plainest self. I have thee in my grasp. I will not bend. I will not see thee flying forth alone. The envy would be more than I could bear. So come with me. Is that not in thy power? Spirit, take my hands. Most faithful friend, for but a little longer I beseech. Continue in thy service to my schemes. And when they are complete, I swear to thee, we shall fly beyond this isle. The corners of the world are mere prologue. I'll seek. To make thy happiness so great that e'en the name of liberty is forgot. What sayest thou to my most hopeful wish? Say yes! <laughs> yes, I am most pleased. Your duty done for now, so go forth hence with haste. I've work to do. That was weird. Thanks. Chloe. I like that though. Well done. An admirable effort. And the ending, absolutely transformative. I am humbled. Oh, we made him happy. No problem. What the hell just happened? Good thing they had two costumes. Is that real? Shake it off. Come on. We'll visit Caliban, my slave. Tis a villain. 
Sir, I do not love to look on. He does make our fire, fetch in our wood. What ho? Slave! What ho? Caliban! Come forth, I say! On! Come on! <laughs> uh, mm. As wicked do, as e'er my mother brushed. Thou poisonous slave, got by the devil himself, filth as thou art. I have lodged thee in mine own cell, till thou didst seek to violate the honor of my child. <laughs> Shit. Aww. He's crying. Fetch us in fuel and be quick. So, Aww. slave, hence. Fuck you. No, Prescott. Where should this music be? In the air or the earth? Oh, thank God. This play is super intense. What is it? A spirit? It carries a brave form, but it is a spirit. No wench. It eats and sleeps and hath such senses as we have. <laughs> I will resist such entertainment. Put thy sword up, traitor! Do you love me? O oh, heaven, O oh, earth, bear witness to this sound. I beyond all limit of what else in the world do love, prize, honor you. His tears run down his beard, like winter's drops from eaves of reeds. Go release them, Ariel. My charms I'll break, their senses I'll restore, and they shall be themselves. Now my charms are all o'erthrown, and what strength I have's mine own. Pray. Release me from my bands with the help of your good hands. That was cool. That was nice. Nice little segment they snuck in there. Wasn't ready for it. Prescott, you were amazing. Man, you really killed it, man. Honestly. Uh, the way he said F you there on stage, that was dope. That was cool. Have you guys ever been in a play? I, know, I only remember one time when I was really, really, really young. Uh, I played Robin Hood. Yeah, I played the hunter. That wasn't Robin Hood. What is it called? Uh, the dwarves. What is it called? Snow White. Wasn't that fun? You're so dead. Yeah? How dead? <laughs> Hella dead. Hella dead. Uh. <laughs> It has a charm to it. I, I do really enjoy these. Oh, it's her. What about that lady? This is a, this is a long one, <laughs> he man. He was shitting himself. <laughs> that dude owes me. It's just uh, I have the green screen set up with two lights and it get, gets really hot in here, but you know, that's it. That's all I'm saying. I'm not complaining. This is fun. I mean, look at that shot. That's a great shot. <laughs> My dear, what if I told you that the entire fate of our production rests upon your slender shoulders? <laughs> I've never had an experience like that on stage. Yeah, right? You- No, you. Like, seriously. 
I love nights after a show. <laughs> Is it always like this? Oh, totally. It's such a high. No more nerves, just the adrenaline. So, first timer, are you proud of yourself? More relief. <laughs> I think I'm just happy it's over. The last 12 hours have been freaking intense. Freaking super duper. Thank you for You've keeping it Christian. So much shit today. Right now is pretty good. It's makeup time. Okay. The whole show was good. Make I out. admit it. Yeah. Makeup time. <laughs> it was magical. Scissor time. But desert time. I just realized they're underage. I meant have a great time. Time. Uh, hold their hand. Well, this is extremely awkward without the music. <laughs> what? Let's leave. For real. For real, huh? You said you wanted to skip town and never look back. Like I said last night. Let's do it. <laughs> I know. I've Seems like you're having a good time here, all though. Day. But that was. <laughs> Don't say it was just a crazy thought. You mean it. I can tell. You want this. Yeah, but, like, eventually. Let's go now. Oh my god, she's crazy! Didn't we already agree on stage? We can't just... <laughs> Why not? What about money? I thought you were a high-rolling criminal now. I collected the money Frank wanted, but then I gave it back to Drew instead. It sounded like he needs it more. No shit. But man, I'm not looking forward to what Frank has to say when he finds out. Maybe a grand I could believe they could run away with, but a anyway, hundred bucks? Come I've got on. more than enough to start us out. I always get birthday money from my dad. Or should I say, hush money. Oh? Any more questions? I know our parents have been shitty, but we can't just leave them. That doesn't sound like Chloe Price. Wouldn't it hurt your mom? She doesn't deserve that, right? I don't deserve to live in the middle of my parents' mistakes. Right. Of course you don't. Okay, fine. You know, fine, fine. Then, you convinced. Drama me. queen, where are we going? <laughs> you tell me. What uniquely twisted location does Chloe Price plus Rachel Amber equal? Hmm. <laughs> oh, of course. Uh, West Coast or okay, open road. I'm feeling like an indefinitely long road trip. That sounds like the greatest idea anyone's ever thought of. You and me driving down the coast. Filling up our truck with hilarious souvenirs, and every night, we'll find a different beach to walk along and watch the sun go down. And one day, you'll be at a gas station fixing the brakes, and some guy with no shirt on will come up. <laughs> yeah, okay. He'll be like, that's so hot that you know about cars. And I'll say, back off. She's with me. <laughs> You're full of shit. <laughs> <laughs> I love this time of night. <laughs> Don't you just feel like everything's possible? <laughs> okay, calm down. Oh, they're gonna kiss! They're gonna kiss! <laughs> or no? Rachel, stop. Oh. If you don't mean this. It's, it's just making me feel like shit that this life you're describing isn't going to happen. For fuck's sake! I've never been more serious in my life. <laughs> Chloe, what would it take to convince you? Oh! I'll pick up tag too! Come on. 
how about, um, Come on. Oh. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Is that convincing enough? Yeah. That is so cute. It even started snowing in ashes. Just imagine uh, hipster music in the background. Eh? Magical moment. Holy shit. I really miss the music now. I don't know what to do about it. It's a shame. What is this stuff? I think it's a sign. I think we should leave tonight. Really? If you want to, I'm ready. Let's go see. Oh, some what? What's the happen the there? And then we'll get the hell out of Arcadia Bay. That sounds perfect. Cute! This is how we run. <laughs> Integrity. Honest. Loyal. Damn. Those doors, man. Hey, what up? You thought you would join him, huh? What's happening? Um. Okay. All right. Okay. 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 All right. They actually modeled the whole house. There must be an important piece then, right? I'm gonna go through all that effort. How about you pick a better time to leave, you know? Poor mom. Oh, you're home. Awkward. Rose, Rachel's home. And she um, brought her new friend. Uh, girlfriend, thank you very much. Our surprise star returns. You're just in time. Dinner's almost ready. Chloe, was it? It was. It was, but that was before I was suspended. Now, it's that girl who used to go here. What was her name again? All one word. Oh, I'm <laughs> so sorry. I didn't mean to bring up any sore subjects. What the hell? Yeah, why is she so <laughs> biffy? Who's sore? Rachel, My honey, <laughs> you were resplendent no. tonight. Thanks. Chloe, so they went you must anyway? join us for dinner tonight. Uh, she must? I must? Of course. I made chicken a la king. <gasps> I'm sure you both acted up quite the appetite. Yeah, no thanks. I'm more of a burger a la king kind of gal. She's funny, this one. I'm aware. Chloe. I know we uh, didn't exactly meet each other at our best this morning, but with you and Rachel becoming such fast friends, I insist you join us for dinner. No, agree, I, we may be fast friends, but yes, I am fast. Of course. Chloe, would you join us for dinner, please? <sighs> of course. Great. I just need to wash off, then I'll be right down. Don't be long. In meantime, perhaps you can help me with the table, Chloe? Sure thing, Mrs. Amber. Okay, I'm gonna go pack. After dinner, we can make our break. You cool down here? Totally. 
Your parents love me. They're good at coming off that way, but don't let your guard down. And, Chloe, we just need to make it through dinner. Try not to say anything that, you know... That I would normally say. Exactly. How did the dad not hear all of that? With the embers. Okay, so did what say. Could possibly go wrong. <laughs> Rachel really was an overachiever before she met me. Glad I nipped that in the bud. I mean, we know something's gonna happen. Something serious is going on. Should we improve the crossword instead of helping out with the table? I'm so bad at crossword. Salvage it. Oh my god. Why would you do that? That is so annoying. All right, let's just help with the stupid dishes. Bothers me how much of a rebel she no is. I feel skeletons. like I have to step in. Lots of shiny dishes, though. Okay, guys. I wonder if this will be the most expensive thing I've ever eaten off of. <laughs> Besides my computer, of course. <sighs> so clean. I bet Rose would kill it with my mom at the diner. Hi, Rose. Your husband's cheating on you. Past hey there, Mrs. Amber. Chloe. I'm so glad you're joining us tonight. So, you putting me to work, or what? Yes. If you could please take four plates from the cupboard and set them on the table. Uh, what if I can't? Excuse me? You said if I could... Never mind. You're a riot, Chloe. All right, Chloe, you've set the table without ruining someone's marriage before. Piece of cake. It's off to the table with you. You forgot the cutlery, but you know, whatever. It's not like you need that to eat! This is gameplay, okay? This is what I want from games. I want to put plates on the table, and I've said it many times, we were close with Cuphead, but table placement is what I want to do with my life. Oh, I don't understand why they're romanticizing this idea of running away all the time. Like this whole grass is always greener kind of shit. It's like, grow up, dude. Yes, Chloe? You're clearly happy here. You just need to stop being an asshole. Plates? Check. Anything else? Actually, could you be a dear and ask Mr. Amber what he'd like to drink with dinner? I will be a dear. Talking to James. As long as I can avoid using the words cheating and scumbag, I should be fine. Hiya, Mr. Amber. Chloe, what can I do for you? What's your vice, Mr. Amber? I'm sorry? Your wife wants to know what kind of drink you're having. Ah, let's say sherry. Okay. One. Two, <laughs> three, uh, 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 Chloe, maybe you can help me understand something. I'll give it a shot. Rose and I, we're worried about Rachel. Yesterday was so unlike her. What do you suppose is going maybe on? Maybe it's a new friend that she has. Oh wait, it's me. 
Besides all my bad behavior rubbing off on her, you mean? Hmm. Another joke. No, i me. No. It seemed like you and Wells were happy to believe that this morning. Rachel is her own person. She's responsible for her actions. I'd be lying if I said I didn't have concerns about your friendship, but perhaps you're exactly who Rachel needs right now as she navigates the choppy waters of adolescence. Nah, I don't know about that one. Good talk, uh, buddy. Thanks. God damn. No. Should we just sit and wait? Is that what they want? That looks comfy. <laughs> Sorry. I pressed it right. I said I didn't think something would. <laughs> you just. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Yes, Chloe? Is dinner ready? The boss man would like a sherry. Thank you. The glasses are in the china cabinet. You can place one at his setting. How am I supposed to get to China? Kidding. <laughs> it's the fancy looking cabinet, right? You got it. I can't do this anymore. Stop. Just stop. Stop. I actually haven't seen the fancy looking cabinet, so I actually don't know what she's talking about. I should stay down here until Rachel is ready. Thank you. I actually went up by accident. But where is the china cabinet? Oh, there it is. Strange Glasses. interior design. Damn. The embers are fancy as shit. Uh, it's the triangle shape one. Basic shapes. <laughs> now you're speaking my language. Too bad you threw away the geometry book. Maybe then you would have known a sherry. This is this is gameplay, guys. This is what I want. This is what I want. Very nice. Okay, okay, okay. Now what? Yes, Chloe? Oh my god. Uh, anything else? What else? <laughs> Feel like I'm getting good at this. Only one last step. As our guest, you may do the honor of lighting the candles. The lighter is in the- It's cool. I've got my own. Oh, oh! You never know when you'll need to light a candle, right? Oh! Uh, you are a uh, paragon of preparedness. Thanks. I think. Oh. Uh, Time to light some candles and pass this joint up a bit. My god. Nothing can stop Chloe now. Nothing. The Amber family and fire. What could possibly go wrong? Here we go. It's dinner time. This one is long, man. If you sat through all of this with me, A plus, man. So, Chloe, Comment are you and Rachel in any of the same classes? Sl slippery. Nipple? Not since this morning. Oh, gosh. I'm so sorry. No. That's cool. <sighs> We're not. What about that fire? <laughs> <laughs> Dinner's really good, Mom. Thank you, Rachel. The way the fire spreads so fast, I've never heard of anything like it. 
Yeah. It's scary. After those floods upstate, I was overjoyed we had less rain this year. Who knew a spring drought could be even more dangerous? You never know where a deadly spark will come from. It's certainly troubling. The latest report from the commissioner's office suggests arson. Arson? Why would anyone do that? Any number of reasons. With everything going on in the world today, even a town like Arcadia Bay isn't immune to the ills of society. I cannot imagine how difficult these last few years have been for you, Chloe. Now that you and Rachel have become friends, I want you to know that our home is always open to you. Always, cool. huh? Thanks. Well said, dear. It's imperative in such troubled times as these that we remember what is most important to us. Family. Family's not merely a gift. It is a responsibility. As such, those we love must be cared for and never, ever taken for granted. Oh. Uh, yeah, that's super true. I and feel like it's, it's not my place to confront even her dad, you know? Like it's not up to me to do that. Ever. You can always run away from whatever is bothering you. As long as you just keep calm. An interesting philosophy, Chloe. Yes, indeed. Not one that I would endorse, however. I favor confronting my problems head on. But to each their own, I suppose. Oh, fucking uh blow me. Oh. Rachel. Oh. Uh, crap. I I'm so clumsy. <laughs> uh, Rachel, can you come help me find another Stop fork? It. Chloe. I can't sit here and listen to this bullshit anymore. Rachel. Stop it, Dad. You're a hypocrite. Okay? I know. You lying, cheating piece of shit, motherfucker. Excuse me? We saw you, yesterday, at the Overlook. James? Kissing that woman. James. Rachel? Honey, whatever you saw or think you saw, I know it's hard, but I need you to trust me. Think we saw? Are you trying to gaslight us? There's no thinking involved. We saw you locking lips with some other woman. Best part is, she and I use the same drug dealer. That's enough. You are not welcome here or around my daughter any longer. I know exactly what kind of person you are from the moment I saw you. And I let my wife's compassion get the better of me. Oh? What kind of person is a that? A delinquent. A broken girl from a broken home. That's enough, James. I will not have you continue to speak to her like this. Uh oh. This is going to be bad. Not the salad. Why can't you just tell me the fucking truth? Stop lying. Stop being a politician for one fucking minute. Can't you just be my dad? Rachel, that woman you saw, that wasn't my It was mistress. a daughter. It was a daughter. Oh my God. Oh my that God. was your mother. Oh, 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 oh. What? Oh my God. That's crazy. I'm freaking out. Oh! What? What a cool story, bruh. I hey, made it fine. Come on, stop crying. Ah. Hey, it's me. What are you doing looking at a prophecy? Mm-hmm. 
Why don't you look at me naked instead, huh? Here's my number. You call me, baby. Very nice. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. What is that play based off? I never heard of it. Yeah, yeah, that's right. That's what you get. Why? Why is that text still there? <laughs> Just realize. She really looks like a man. Did they actually run away? No. We know that Rachel is going to die. But we don't know how. It's probably gonna happen in the next episode. Oh, That's cute. I um, I actually like this one. That was a good ending. He still kissed the mom, though. Right? It still doesn't really explain. Life is strange before the storm. Episode 2. Let's look at our choices. Let's see what we picked. It's always interesting to find out. Uh, I like this one. I think it could be a little tighter. You know, it was very long. It's 2 hours and 30 minutes. And I think it's 3 hours if you play it probably slower than I do. Uh, it's just like... It doesn't feel... I feel like there's a lot of dialogue. I think there's a lot of stuff that can be cut. And they don't have to put it in. I don't know if they need to make it longer to justify the price of the game. But personally, I, don't, I wouldn't have any issue with it being shorter. Because it does feel pretty dragged at some points. But overall, it's really good. And you feel satisfied by the end of it. So it's, uh, it's interesting. It's a shame about the music. Because uh, it's kind of, kind of what makes it so good. But... Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it anyway. And if you sat through all of this with me, that's awesome. I that's a that's a cool thing. I appreciate that. I, I really do. And uh, I hope you enjoyed hanging out with me for two hours and twenty minutes, or however long it's been. Do I not get to see the? Okay, there we go. You took the blame for Rachel. Um, eighty percent people did. Okay, you emptied your pockets. Sixty-two percent did. You gave Damon the money. A lot of people. Didn't give Damon the money, huh? That that one seemed kind of uh, obvious to me, cause maybe maybe it changed, you know, cause you had the option to go out. Uh, but I'm glad we got the one where we gave the money to Damon, cause I think that was the right choice. And you asked Rachel for a kiss. Twelve percent was like, ah, I just want to, I just want a tattoo, okay, or maybe a friendship bracelet. <laughs> But other than that, that was it. Thank you guys again so much. I hope you enjoyed. I forgot that there's this. Okay, sorry. Oh my god. What's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? Episode 3, Hella Empty. Let's watch. I'll play it, of course. And uh, that's it. Squad fam.